And a warm welcome. Our venue for this game is the Emirates Stadium in North London. Derek Ray here on the commentary box, joined as always by former England defender Lee Dixon. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It's Arsenal up against Tottenham Hotspur. I'm excited, Derek. Really looking forward to this game. Come on, bring it on. You have to think, Lee, Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang's natural goal-scoring presence could make a difference here. Well, three goals in his last three games, Derek, breeds confidence in a player. The defenders will be watching him like a hawk. And this is the Arsenal starting eleven. Bernd Leno stands between the posts. Thomas Partey starts with Granit Xhaka in the centre of the pitch. And finally, the forwards, Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang starts with Alex Lacazette. And Spurs will go with this starting 11. Hugo Lloris is the goalkeeper. Davinson Sanchez starts alongside Toby Alderweireld in central defence. Hyung Min Son plays with Eric Lamela out wide. And the centrepiece of the attack today is Harry Kane. Thank you for attending the Emirates Stadium. Enjoy the match. And this confrontation is underway. <laughs> David Luiz. Bukayo Saka. Thomas now. And promising stuff from Arsenal. They couldn't maintain possession. Saka. And they'll get ready for the throw in. It looks promising. And a useful cross. Making sure nothing came of it. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. Well, it didn't happen for them in attack. Ndombele. Son. Harry Kane, Fabier, Lucas with it, We're getting the ball forward, and the pass could do damage, and a goal here from Harry Kane, he's up on the scoring, what a boost for his team. Well here's the goal again, and it's a great ball to put him through, and then through on goal, you never really had any doubt he was going to slot that away, good finish. One nil then. Saka. It's with Erdogan. Arsenal pushing forward with options available. This could square the game. And that's exactly what has transpired. Now, that could be a massive turning point, and momentum is with them.
Well, here it is again. The through ball is perfectly timed. It causes havoc. And how strong was he here? Incredible to hold off the defenders and get his shot away. Lovely goal. Yes, a show of emotion, and why not? They're back in this game on. Even Steven won a piece on this match. Lucas. Bukayo Saka. Oh, that's an interesting pass. And the decision offside here. Ndombele. Lucas. And Javier with it. Crisp tackling. And a goal kick is the outcome. Lacazette. Aubameyang Lacazette Lacazette and it's a double for him in this game no way for the opposition to contain him and no wonder he's off celebrating well here's the replay and it starts with a lovely one-two pass and then through on goal do you go for placement or do you go for power well, he certainly wasn't messing around, was he? Absolutely smashes it past the keeper. It's a really lovely finish. Well, he's every right to be angry. The players are not executing his game plan today. Now having fallen behind, what sort of response will that elicit from the Spurs team? Lucas. Here's Ndombele. And a Tottenham Hotspur free kick coming up. Harry Kane. Can he do it? And it nestles on the back of the net. A goal for Tottenham Hotspur, who now are on level terms. Well, it is good play. You might question the defending, but I prefer to be positive. Really good build-up and an easy finish. Well, the goal again, albeit from a different angle. And it's level again here. Both sets of fans being put through something of an emotional mangle. Nicola Pepe. Martin Odegaard. Granit Xhaka. Well, they couldn't keep possession. Well, we are going to have a decent amount of stoppage time. Three minutes to be exact. Pepe. And the timing was perfect. Ball one. Beautifully timed. And the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. Alex Lacazette, when he's on song, really can be...
The teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. Lamela. Now Harry Kane. Working away patiently, looking for an opening. Effective challenge. Thomas. Arsenal have given it away. Lucas. Kane. Going about his defensive business with a minimum of fuss. Tierney. On to Pepe. Granit Xhaka. Passing it around, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Martin Odegaard. Xhaka. And here's Partey. Lamela with it. Lucas. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Well, that's a super ball over the top. And he's in. Lucas! And there is the goal to re-establish their advantage! Well, as we look at this again, the keeper's every right to ask where his back line was, but... 2v1 in the end, he's thinking now, is he going to pass or go around me? He's got no chance. Well, it can be difficult being a manager at times, none more so than now. It will be very instructive to see how Arsenal respond to that setback. Martin Odegaard. Now Lacazette. Obama Yang. Arsenal have given it away. Reguilon. So 20 minutes to go. Can they trouble the opposition this time? And a tidy tackle. Obama Yang. Shaka. And a fine tackle. Ndombele. Spurs get the advantage from the referee. Well, they're quite content to knock it around inside their own half. In with a chance. And they've bought themselves a bit of time. So and still danger here. Threat over for now, it seems. Well, can these Arsenal players respond to the amazing energy from the fans? It's electric. A chopping challenge, and the referee has got to have a big think about it. And the referee decided that intervention was illegal and cautionable. Oh, without question, it was not the best of challenges. Kane. Lamela. And Spurs moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? Aurier. Ndombele. And the challenge halts them in their tracks. This might be the perfect counter attacking opportunity. And it's a quality pass. This could square the game. But no, thanks to the goalkeeper, opportunity not taken. Well, it's the last line of defence for a reason. The back four looking back, and he saved them.
And now the delivery. Not getting a strong fist on the ball. Partey. Oh, great defending. The final whistle, and the Gunners go down. They've lost this game. No points picked up. Lee, what did you think of it? Well, nobody likes losing, Derek, but when it's such fine margins, it makes it hard to take. Still some positives, though, and they will regroup and surely go again. Well, Lucas Moura, in typical fashion, kept asking questions. And, Lee, I wonder what you made of his contribution. Well, he's always a danger, isn't he? No more so when he grabbed that goal. He never disappoints me when I watch him. He's just too good, simple.